All right, guys, so I just woke up and uh, literally all around my room, like all my stuff are gone. Like, what the heck? I literally have some books, a little bit of water. Uh, what is this? Hand sanitizer and a crowbar. I don't know what's going on, but I'm not liking it because uh, all my stuff is gone. Let me go see what's going on here. The heck? Who the, who, who the heck, who the heck put all my stuff out here? I can't, uh, I can't even, who did this? My name is Officer Joe, and if you're wondering why all your stuff is missing, it's because I took them all out because I want to challenge you to a 24 hour prison challenge. There are two ways to escape this prison. You can either one, using that crowbar to break out but if i catch you you will never come out of jail again and the second option you have six tasks to complete each task will reduce four hours of your sentence and if you complete them all you will have zero hours zero minutes on your jail time and you have 24 hours to escape are you ready for this challenge oh yeah yeah I i'm ready for sure yeah yeah all right, your first task is to clean up that messy bed because I'm gonna start you off with an easy challenge because I know you're not gonna survive this prison challenge. All right, guys, so I guess I just gotta clean up my bed and then I'll get an easy four hours off my sentence. I mean, it doesn't seem that bad. And he said that the challenges weren't gonna get any easier, so uh, I'm a little bit nervous for that, but... And he said I could break out or complete my task, but he said if I break out, then if he catches me, I'll never escape jail. I'm just gonna go clean my bed. Um, I think for now, I'm just gonna complete my task, man. I'm gonna try to be a good man and try to reduce my sentence the right way. So let me go uh, make up my bed real quick. Get an easy four hours off my sentence. All right, my bed is now made up. And I mean, now we're at 20 hours of our sentence. Let's go. Guys, he left some books in here, but uh, I don't know if I want to read these, man. I might read this one, though. I don't know. There's not really much in here to do, but just sit around, man. The prison's boring. He even took my monitors, my PC. Dang, what am I supposed to do for fun? Hey! I got your breakfast, so open up. All right, I'm coming, dang. What is this? What do you mean? That's your breakfast, so eat it. Dang, well, I know you wanted me to do this challenge, but you could at least give me some quality food, man. Come on, it's not that serious. All right, guys, so uh, I just got my breakfast. Uh, the really mean prison guards handed me this, and uh, we're about to try this. Oh, it looks like this is some, like, tuna or something. I mean, it's not that bad. I mean, yeah, I guess this is breakfast, so um, I just got to eat this up see what's next for today, see what kind of tests we gotta do, or maybe we wanna break out. Just keep that down, I don't want him to hear me. All right guys, so one thing that I found out that I really like to do to pass the time is lifting weights, cause in this boring prison, there's nothing to do. And uh, yeah, man, there's nothing else to do, but just get jacked, just lift weights to pass the time. Just checking on you. All right guys, so Officer Joe just uh, came by a few minutes ago and he comes around like every hour or so to uh, come and check up on me. And um, I think I think right now is the perfect time to escape. All right guys, so the crowbar should be over here. I don't really want him to hear me. All right, got the crowbar. All right, we're gonna attempt to break out and I can't wait to get all my stuff back. Yes, come on. Oh, how the heck do I do this? Oh, oh, it moved. Oh, it's moving. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, uh, uh, nothing, nothing. I'm just, just lonely, you know. It's lonely in here. I'm just looking out, man. All right, well, since you're so lonely, uh, I can, I can get you a cellmate. Joseph, come in here. Hey, 
I'm gonna be your new cellmate. Oh, what is up, my guy, Joseph? Guys, we got a new cellmate. His name is Joseph, and um, I guess we're gonna be cellmates for uh, the rest of the remaining time here. All right, guys, so me and Joseph have been just laying here. You know, we're just, you know, laying down, trying to pass the time, but we can't lay down for too long or sleep because, you know, Officer Joe's gonna come by and be like, get up, go do this, go work out. And uh, me and Joseph are really tired of this place, man. What do you wanna do, Joseph? You wanna try to escape? Ooh. All right, well, uh, we gotta wait till uh, Officer Joe comes back. And uh, you know he's gonna come back every hour or so, so we gotta wait for him to come back and then we'll make our great escape. All right, Joseph, remember, if we get caught, it's, it was your idea, okay? All right, Joseph, remember, he won't come back until an hour later, so you got plenty of time to do this. Whoa, whoa, Joseph, you're doing it. What the? Now, what the? How? Who opened this? Aha, uh -huh, I knew it. It's you, Joseph. Yeah, you're coming with me. Yeah, I knew you were up to no good, Joseph. Now you're staying in jail forever. All right, guys, so it is now lunchtime and uh, Officer Joe hasn't gave me a task in a while. You know, I wonder what he's up to. He came by earlier and told me it was lunchtime and he handed me some nasty food and I was like, nah. I took it and uh, I just put it down to the side because I'm going to make my own food. And pretty much I'm going to be making my lunch today. It's called a jailhouse brick or hookup. All right, so first you want to get your chips right. And uh, you pretty much just want to crush these up. All right, so I'm going to open it because like there's air in this. So like, you want to crush it up just like this. And uh, it should look something like this. And next, this is the same thing, just like with the chips. You're gonna wanna crush up your noodles, all right? So you just wanna just crush them all up nice and good until they're almost like the same as the chips, but obviously these are noodles, so they're gonna be different. All right, so next you wanna put your chips inside the bowl, just like so, and you wanna pour up your noodles in here. I'm not gonna put the entire thing, and some of these aren't really crushed at, like all the way, so. I'm just gonna crush up these ones a little bit more. And next, you wanna take your meat and you just wanna like, you wanna cut it up just like this. Maybe cut it up into more smaller pieces. All right, so once all the meat is nice and cut up just like this, you just put it in there. And then you just mix it up again. You just mix it up so everything's nice and mixed. And you wanna put your chicken flavor in there. Just pour it up in there for that, for that extra seasoning, you know. All right, guys, so once you got all this stuff mixed up, you want to pour this back into the hot Cheetos or Cheetos bag. All right, that should be good. And uh, you want to pour your hot boiling water in here. Don't ask how I got this in prison. I know some people. And then you're supposed to close it up and uh, you just let it cook. You just let it sit and you uh, let it cook. What do you think it's nasty? Who wants to try it? All right, Jude, you can try it. The jail brick. What, what is that? Come on, Jude, try it. Okay. That's like I have nothing. some chips. Look, get some. You know what? You're going in jail for 24 hours next. Oh. Uh... <laughs> Oh, hey, lucky you. You only have a few hours left on your sentence. Oh my God, thank God, because I've lost track of the time and my head is just spinning in here. I don't know what to do. It's so boring in here and I just cannot wait to get out. And you probably noticed I've been going easy on you with the task because I noticed you were being pretty good in there. But the last task I want you to do is to give me a tattoo because, uh, my mom t told me I could never get a tattoo ever, and I never got one, and uh, recently she just passed away, and now I'm gonna get a tattoo. What the heck, dude, that's horrible. 
Why would you want me to make a tattoo? We could just go out there and go get one professionally. Because I want to see if you're worthy enough for me to only give you so little task and to let you come out of prison. All right, all right, I wanna get out of jail, so just give me the tattoo thing. Let's just get this over with so I can go home. Oh my God, yes, yes, I'm finally, I'm finally free. Oh, you guys don't understand how good it feels to be out of that jail already. We're making it to the end of the video. You guys are amazing. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, 24 hours in prison. If you like this video, make sure you guys subscribe for more things like this on the channel because there definitely is some there. And thank you for 100 subscribers again. And it's been Jaden and I'm out. Peace. Never ever find the right words And there's no way this is real life There's no telling you're the right girl So I can only say that it feels right